Welcome to Brooker Ceramics and this week we're looking at making these really nice simple bowls. This video I've made a little mini tutorial and is part of a larger tutorial series and what I'll be showing you in this one is how to pull the clay up and then how to shape it into this bowl shape that we've got here. This follows on from the previous video which was opening up the clay itself so if you haven't seen that I'd go back uh, in the playlist and just take a look at that one first and then come back here and uh, have a look at what we've got in store. So I'm going to take you down to the pottery wheel and we're going to begin doing some throwing. So this is how I pull the clay and I'll explain what I'm doing in detail in just a sec. So the first couple of pulls are to get the height of the bowl. Um, we want to leave the rim relatively thick because as we open it up and out into that flat bowl shape, the rim will become thinner and thinner. So this is still a bit too short. I'm going to open it, lift it up one more time. So this bowl is relatively open and flat, so now that I've got the right height, I can begin pulling it out. And again, it's the same motion, but as I'm pinching, I'm pulling it out. And you want to do this really, really slowly so that the structure of the clay um, retains its shape. If you do it too quick, it will just collapse. So you can see now with the first pull, the uh, the lip is relatively thin now. Uh, so that's why it's really important to make sure it's extra thick uh, when uh, throwing a, quite a wide bowl like this. So I'm going to continue to repeat the process until I got the shape, the rough shape that I want. So now I've got that rough um, bowl shape. What I'm going to do now is finalise the shape with this wooden kidney and it also allows me to remove the excess slip from outside of the bowl. Now the outside is more or less finished. I just want to finish off the, the inside of the bowl um, as well as the lip. So to do this, I'm just going to come in with a sponge and just remove any of the excess. So now I've got the rough bowl shape form roughed in. Uh, what I'm going to do is let it dry out for 24 hours and then come back in with the wooden kidney and uh, burnish the inside as well. And this just helps finalize that shape and clean up the inside of the bowl. And then it'll leave it to dry another 24 hours and then I can begin trimming it up. So I'm gonna remove it from the bat 
and we're going to come back in 24 hours and burnish the insides. So I hope you enjoyed this mini tutorial and stay tuned for the next one to come. I'll be focusing on trimming.